is Rashna Madan and I will be reading the story The Bone Puzzle by Lavina Mehbubani. Stop pulling my hair, shouts Zoya. First you stop calling me back so, Arman yells at his sister. Children, behave yourselves, says Ma. Remember, you are at my clinic. There are patients waiting outside. Both of you are disturbing them. But Ma, enough. If I hear another sound from either of you, I will punish you both, says Ma sternly. One, two, three. A few seconds pass in silence, but the peace does not last. This is your fault, Zoya. Why do you have to be so stupid? Why are you calling stupid, Slopo? You can't even spell stupid. Stop calling me names. I'll tell Ma, says Arman, pinching Zoya's arm. You're such a tattletale says Zoya, shoving her brother. Arman loses his balance. He topples over backwards and bumps into something hard. Crash! Oh no! Zoya and Arman stare at the pile of bones lying on the ground. See what a mess you've made of Ma's skeleton model, says an upset Zoya. This is all your fault. You're the one who pushed me, yells Arman. We'd better do something quickly, otherwise we'll both be in trouble, says Zoya. Arman nods and picks up a bone. This one must be the head bone. It has two holes for eyes, one hole for the nose and teeth below. You're right, says Zoya. That's definitely the head bone. This is like a puzzle. We just need to figure out which bone goes where. Where do you think this goes? Asks Zoya, picking up a big cage-like bone. Um, well... Arman makes a fist with his hand and wraps the middle part of his body. I think that the cage on top must be the chest and the space below must be for the tummy. Soya nods and smiles. The two of them hold the piece together and mount it onto the stand. Look at this piece. Don't these bones look like finger bones? Asks Soya, wiggling the small bones at Arman. I think this is an arm. Can you look for the other one? How do you know that this isn't a leg bone? Asks Arman. Watch me. Soya sits down and places her hand flat on the floor next to her foot. In no time, Arman finds the other arm bone and two leg bones. The hand bones are shorter than the foot bones. We must be right, says Arman. Soya stands on tiptoe to fix the arm bones while Arman attaches the leg bones to the skeleton. They hear Ma's voice outside telling a patient to get rest and visit again in a week. It sounds like she's almost done. Only the skull remains to be fixed. Oh no, they can't reach. Quick, Arman, pull that chair here, whispers Zoya. She climbs onto the chair and places the skull right at the top of the skeleton. Arman drags the chair back to its place, just in time. We've done it, Zoya hugs Arman. Ma walks in. It's nice to see the two of you hugging. I'm done for the day. Let's go get ice cream, she says. By the way, you both were very clever to put the skeleton back together correctly, says Ma. Zoya and Arman look at each other in surprise.